Okay, so we've chosen our theme. We've added a couple of posts, uh, so we've got some content on there. The next thing is to add the contact form. So let's click on contact here. And here we can choose the information that we collect. Um, so this is some uh, HTML here. So we've got your name, your email, subject, and message. Um, we don't particularly want subject and well subjects in particular so let's take take that one out just press delete there to move that up so we've got name email let's also add phone number the easiest way to do that is to copy this control C to copy or you could right click and select copy enter enter right click and paste change email to telephone number and if you change this one to text, well, I'll show you how to do it the easy way. Just select select that and delete it. Then go to generate tag, text field. It's a required field. We'll put it your phone. Call it your phone. And then copy this code. Cop right click and copy. And let's click there and paste it in. Okay, so there is one other thing to do. Scroll down to where it says mail, and we're going to want to change this so it says from, and then instead of subject, we want it to say telephone number. So we've changed that. So the field is called your phone here. Copy that and paste it there. So this is the email that you will receive. It will appear to come from the person that's sent the form. Let's change subject to will inquiry. Uh, we've got the body of their message as well. So then let's uh, click on save and this is the the form um, code to copy so click on there right click and copy then click on appearance and then click on widgets now widgets are simply um, items that appear on the side of your page in what's called the sidebar. So let's use the text one, drag it up, up to the top, and put it onto the sidebar there. And we'll put here request more information and just paste the code in there. It's as simple as that. Click on save. It's saved, close that off and click on visit site to see how that looks. Wait for it to load. Okay, I keep getting this error here, so I think I better change the theme. I think this theme has got a bug in it, but um we can see here that the contact form is added. So let's quickly show you how to change the theme if you want to. So we click on themes, click on install themes at the top. Let's look at the featured themes. The featured one shouldn't really have any bugs in. Let's try this one here. Click on install now and activate. Let's visit the site again. So see how easy that was to um, update. Oh, and the interesting thing on this theme is you've got the categories at the top. So if I create another category, uh, it, will, it will make a menu at the top of the screen. And then when, when people click on that, they'll see all the posts in that particular category. Of course, it's easy for people to request information just by filling in that form. 
Okay, in the next video I'll show you how to add a picture to make it a, um, a bit more interesting.